You already going on that? Yep. Oh, yeah. Well, fuck Ohio State. And hey, we out here at Ohio State University. They, they a bunch of faggots. All the football players, Ohio State football team, they're all a bunch of faggots. Urban Meyer, he's a faggot. <laughs> he's a Jew piece of shit. His last name's Meyer. See, to be successful in America, you gotta be a so-called Jew. You know what I'm saying? You gotta be a so-called Jew who not they're actually Edomites. Up in the synagogues, they teach that they actually the Edomites, that AKA the children of Satan. Yeah, because the so-called Jews, yeah, we're gonna get on the Jews. That's just the spirit. Yeah, the so-called Jews, they control Hollywood, they control the government. What's nice for senators? All the bunch of goddamn Jews, like that bitch Diane Feinstein. That's an ugly bitch too. Bernie Sanders. Uh, what's your boy Joe Biden? The vice president, Joe Biden. He was wearing a uh, a yarmulke on his head, a little Jew hat, a Juden hut. He was wearing a, a Jew hat on his head. All right. So that the government's controlled by Jews. All the news channels, they're controlled by Jews. Turn on CNN, what do you see? Goddamn Wolf Blitzer, a motherfucking Jew. A goddamn Jew. And then all the Jews in Hollywood, Steven Spielberg, Joel Silver. If we go on down the list, everybody's a goddamn Jew, okay? You name an actor, Jew, okay? Just like all, all the, the Jews control the music industry. We was just watching them, uh, some Metallica on YouTube. I guess who Metallica's manager is? What's his name? Cliff Bernstein? Goddamn Jew. So the Jews is in control of everything. They're a bunch of devils. Alright? They're a bunch of actually, they're a bunch of child molesters too. When a so-called Jew is first has a baby boy, when they have a baby boy, and when he's first born, and they circumcise the baby. When they circumcise the baby, they have a, a rabbi suck the blood out the baby's penis. Oh, you can look, 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 get on Google and type in uh, Jew rabbi sucks baby penises. What are, what is that? Yeah, well, I made it. We talked about it a lot before in the videos. Like little children, little Jew uh, devil babies, they died from herpes and AIDS. All right, there's numerous cases that was in the news a little baby's dying or catching herpes or AIDS from the Jewish circumcision ritual. But these are the same devils that run Hollywood and that make all your children's cartoons. When you, cause all like all these women, they'll sit their child in front of the TV and that's the babysitter, you know what I'm saying? But really when you sit your children in front of all these cartoons, you're, it's like you're leaving them with the little rabbi, with the rabbi, that's what you're doing. When you leave your child, in front of a TV by himself all day, you're leaving him with the, with the, with the child molesting rabbi, pretty much. That's who's making those cartoons. Yo, yeah, check this out. Hit it up on you if you get a chance. Two more New York babies stricken with herpes as the rabbi suck their penis during Jewish ritual. The goddamn Jew devil. They're not the Edomites. They're not Jews. They're not the real Jews. We're the real Jews. They're a bunch of cocksuckers, a bunch of faggots. That's right. Revelation 2 and 9. Um, I know thy works in tribulation and poverty, but thou art rich. That's and talking about us. We're rich. We don't have physical riches. We have spiritual riches. Keep going. Which is much, much more valuable than physical shit. Yep. And I know the blasphemy of them which say they are Jews and are not, but are the synagogue of Satan. That's the so-called Jews over there in the state of Israel. All right, over there oppressing the Palestinians. All right, and that's the most people want to call us racist, but them so-called Jews—they're the most racist country on the planet Earth. Don't you know? Uh, over there, it's against the law to marry a non-Jew. You know what I mean? Because you know, if you if, 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 here in America, the, the Jew would tell you on TV that everybody has to come together. You know what I mean? When you watch the movies. And when, when they pass all these laws uh, uh, against hate speech and all this, you're not allowed to show hatred towards any other, to all these nationalities. We all have to love the Chinese and Hindus and the Buddhists and uh, and all the Africans, and we all gotta live together. 
You right, know what I mean? Right, right. But over there in their country, them so them, them Jews, they don't practice it in their own country. That's right. You know what I'm saying? They're a bunch of hypocrites and devils, man. Check this out, bro. This is Zechariah not eight and six. Eight, uh, no, nine and six. And a bastard shall dwell in Ashdod. And I will cut off the pride of the Philistines. And Ashdod is a poor city in that rat city of Israel right now where we're rat blood. Oh, they are a bastard. They're not Israelites. But actually, they're our brother. Because Esau is Jacob's brother. They're our evil brother. You know what I mean? It's like, you ever play, <laughs> you ever play uh, Metal Gear? You had Liquid Snake? Yeah. Well, you had Solid Snake and Liquid Snake. Liquid <laughs> Snake, he, he was the evil brother. You know what I mean? That was my shit. Yeah. <laughs> it's, just like, it's just like uh, Cain and Abel. All right. One brother was good and one was evil. You know what I'm saying? You got the positive and the ne negative. All right, go ahead. Um, this is Revelation 3 and 9. Um, Behold, I will make them of the synagogue of Satan, which say they are Jews and are not, but do lie. Behold, I will make them to come and worship before thy feet. So all them so-called Jews over there in Israel claiming to be Jews and the Lord's chosen people, they gonna bow down. They gonna they gonna lick the dust of our feet. They gonna literally, bow down. Literally. Yeah, literally. L hey, yeah. Uh, where is you? Skip back to uh, Revelation two and uh, nineteen. Revelation two and nineteen. I, I think nineteen. I know thy works in charity and service and faith and thy patience and thy work and the last to be more than the first. Right. Uh, what the works is you know doing the work teaching the Bible. Keep going. Notwithstanding, I have a few things against thee, because thou sufferest that woman Jezebel, which calleth herself a prophetess, yeah, that sounds just like these church bitches, to teach and to seduce my servants to commit fornication. Oh, that's another thing. Them so-called Jews, they're the main ones behind the women rights movement, behind the women liberation movement, mm -hmm. all right? They're the main ones behind, they're the ones behind all that shit. They were clever with that. That was some clever shit. Yeah, now, like I said, the Jews, they're the ones who own Hollywood and the music industry. Look at all the famous uh, women singers. They're all sluts. Miley Cyrus, uh, a goddamn whore. Okay, dresses like a whore, acts like a whore. Beyonce. Beyond, a goddamn whore, okay, a slut. She wants to be a white woman. Beyond, <laughs> she's on TV all the time doing Illuminati devil worshiping ceremonies. All right, a goddamn whore. Who are all these other you name a you name a female in the music industry and she's a goddamn whore. Hollywood. All all the actresses, they all a bunch of sluts. Just like all these women out here, a bunch of a no good filthy whores, man. He just look at it like this bitch is a goddamn hoe. You hear about that stupid bitch in MMA, man, wants to fight for it, Mayweather. Oh, that's, you hear about that shit, man. No, nah, I didn't hear it, but yeah, she can ask for it. Floyd Mayweather could Knock the shit out of the biggest bitch on the planet Earth. Yeah, kill that bitch. Yeah, literally kill, it. kill her. It doesn't even matter who it is. Right. It's been so high up on her horse that she wouldn't think she gonna beat the man. Hold up, if it wasn't no. Ronda Rousey, was it? We shouldn't be disappointed. Uh, it wasn't Ronda Rousey, was I can't, it? I'm the champion bitch. I don't uh, know her name. Look, yeah, she gets everyone the arm bar. Actually, yeah, that's her, that's actually her, I pray to the most high that he lets that happen. I, I, I'm here. I actually, that's a good idea. Mm -hmm. Actually, it's a good. They should let women in the NFL too. Yeah, that's yeah. a good idea. Please do it. Yeah. I want to see a bitch get paralyzed on the first hit. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Bitch gonna be a goddamn paraplegic for the rest of her life. Right. You know what I mean? Just one hit, the first hit, and she's out. First hit. Out for the career. Oh, they're fine. Dude. It's like hitting her though. Oh they yeah. Pass then they don't change the. Then they'll start turning into flag football. Yep. Ain't change no more laws and they don't get only can tackle her a certain way. Oh, man. I hit her anyway. Fuck it. Yeah, yeah. You shouldn't be out there. I mean, because a woman's body's not designed to be punished like that. Nor for stress. A period. woman's not designed for combat. That's right. Okay. Actually, men, we're, we're designed for combat. Mm -hmm. we're, 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 the Lord created us as killing machines, actually. That's right. That's right. When we had that power. You know what I'm saying? Because the Lord said the Lord is a man of war. The Lord is his name. To the most high, he likes war. You know, that's... That war, I mean... It is kind of beautiful yeah, when you look at it. It really is. So where do you get all the honor and the glory from? It's from war. When, when you, somebody speaks of a hero, 
well, first thing in your mind pop when you hear the word heroes, somebody who defeated all and slain all of his enemies in combat. That's right. You know what I'm saying? You know, a man, we, our bodies get stressed. We get stressed out at work. We come home and get a bottle. These bitches get stressed out. They they look for uh, 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 pills, you know? Yeah. A cock. Psych psychedelic pills, psychedelic pills. Zoloft. 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 Zoloft, that shit just sounds scary. That sounds like some like, evil wizard made. Zoloft. You know what I mean? That's a, that's a wizard pill, man. That's who made it, a wizard. A goddamn, actually, the word wizard, a warlock. the word wizard come from the word wise. The wise are, the wise are. That's somebody with a lot of wisdom, but uh, with the evil sense. He's got a lot of wisdom and wickedness, all right? Cause just like all these, a lot of these uh, computer programmers out in Silicon Valley, a lot of them they got a lot of wisdom, but a lot of them are faggots too and devil worshippers. They're part of satanic cults. They're raping each other in the ass and uh, uh, molesting children and devil worshiping ceremonies. That's the type of shit to go down with all these rich people. All these, all these rich people they're all Freemasons. All, like all the rich kids that go to Ohio State University. They go down uh, and become part of a fraternity. And they pledge their allegiance to Zeus and Apollo. They worship Athena and all the Greek gods. That's why they call it a Greek fraternity. They worship the Greek gods. They pop each other. Yeah, and they, they made movies about it. That movie with Will Ferrell. They showed out, was that old school? They showed you in that movie how to become part of the fraternity. That it was all tying ropes to the dicks and doing some gay shit. What's that movie with Matt Damon? Uh, that's a, that's a Robert De Niro movie. When they was pissing off the balcony on two. That was two. about Skull and Bones, yeah, uh, yeah. The Good Shepherd. Is that what it is? The Good Shepherd? I never could remember that, man. I've been wanting to download it and watch yeah, it. Yeah, they man. showed you that in that they movie. They pissing on them. Pissing yeah. on while they wrestling butt naked. And that, yeah, that, to become part of Skull and Bones, you gotta let people piss on you and rape you in the ass. Oh. That's a George Bush to be, and, and John Kerry. You know, everybody hates George Bush. Oh, he's the devil. But y'all praising goddamn Obama and the Secretary of State is goddamn George Bush's cousin, John Kerry. So y'all a bunch of dumbasses, man. And that's amazing when you think about it. And John, look, and John Kerry and George Bush were both part of Skull and Bones. So they both was pissing on each other and raping each other in the ass. They probably raped each other. You know what I'm saying? There's nothing to need of Mike. And John Kerry's, like I said, is Barack Obama's Secretary of State. They keep it all in the family. You know what I'm saying? Because you'll find out that Barack Obama is related to Dick Cheney. They keep it all in the family. So, oh, Barack Obama's the great black man. He's going to leave black people to salvation. <laughs> Y'all need punch in your face, man. Barack Obama's going to leave us to salvation. That's what they say. Yeah, I'm here. Dumbasses will leave that shit, too. Yeah, Jamie Foxx called him the Messiah. Yeah, Jamie Foxx. A great faggot. A big faggot. And this video's on YouTube where Jamie Foxx said that he wanted to fuck Prince. Did you see that? I saw the one he where he actually said he wanted said to fuck that. Lenny Kravitz. He, he want <laughs> he want to fuck all kind of people. He probably all kind of men. He probably done did it though. Yeah, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They heard him say it and they're like, oh, I want to fuck you too. Cause they're all the faggots. One of my favorites that he said he wanted to. Hey, he wants to make some sweet love to Lenny Kravitz. Too far East Bay. Lenny Kravitz looks like a big fan. He's all, yeah, all feminine and shit. All singing all soft all the time and shit. And to eat things sacrificed unto idols, and I gave her space to repent of her fornication, and she repented not. Yeah, so we've been out here teaching for a minute. The elders have been teaching forever. And y'all still ain't get it, so the most high gave y'all time. Okay, there's no excuse. Oh, go ahead. Behold, I will cast her into a bed, and them that commit adultery with her into great tribulation, except they repent of their deeds. Yeah, so all these women out here, they got that Jezebel spirit on them. You know what I'm saying? They got the spirit of Jezebel, which is a which is a trifling ass horse, the spirit of a whore. The spirit of a, a a bitch, a slut. A foul bitch, right? A foul, what's the word? There's another word, a harlot. Mm -hmm. a tr uh, there's gotta be a better word in it. This is a no good, 
a no good whore. <laughs> a dog. Yeah, a dog. That's a good word. There you go. A, a damn dirty dog. That, oh, that's why the buy. I'll get that scripture. Yeah, a damn well. dirty dog, right? A damn dirty dog that will lay down literally with everybody in any fucking body. And the bitch had fleas too. You know? Ugh, God. Yep, yep, yep. Yep. That's why these women out here, they all got diseases. That's why the, the Center for Disease and Control, what they said that over half of, of America got venereal diseases. Hey, right, just even better, man. They said one out of every white uh, 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 woman that has AIDS, 20 other are black females that have it. That's scary. You know, I'd be, so be scared of fucking more black bitches. You get what the fuck you deserve, you lay down with one of these nasty black bitches. Bitches be look good as hell, like, God damn, she got a fat ass. Yeah. Man, be, man, she got AIDS, too. Yeah, yeah. Look good, too. Yeah. Yeah, which will look good, too. You got AIDS. And along with AIDS, probably got syphilis, AIDS, herpes. Be scared. You know, all kinds of shit like that. It, yeah, you, before you, yeah, before you fuck a bitch, you gotta throw up a prayer. <laughs> Same thing when you eat a meal, you eat food. What you doing, baby, in that closet? <laughs> How long you been in that front closet, baby? Oh, yeah. In the closet, praying. In the closet. <laughs> These some foul bitches, man. They dumb as hell. Come buckets, you know. Ecclesiasticus 26 and 25. A shameless woman shall be counted, excuse me, I'm, <clears throat> Boys a shameless woman shall be counted as a dog. As a fucking dog. Why else would the Bible mention a woman being a fucking dog unless she was a foul, filthy animal? That's an animal. You know? They lay down literally with every fucking thing in anybody. Yeah. You know? Shit. Just like when a dog, every last dog, <laughs> shit, sniff every last person's ass to walk by. Just, <laughs> you just know what I mean? Just like, just like a dog would eat shit, a woman would do the same thing. Would do the same thing, especially if they put some money in her pocket. Oh, yeah. Especially if they oh, put shit. money in her pocket. A woman would do anything for money. I mean, it's all over the internet, ain't it? Yeah. They eat shit. Oh, that, what's that, that video was real famous, uh, Two Girls in a Cup. Oh. What's that, is that, a, is that what it's called? Two that's Girls two in a Cup. Two Girls in a Cup. Two gr just Google that, Two Girls in a Cup. Hey, that's so popular, man, everybody. I, I, I know about it, I ain't watch it, though. I knew what was in it. I already knew what was in it. Yeah, I heard about so it. So I couldn't watch it. You know what I'm saying? But I already seen other videos though. Oh man. I seen other videos though. Horses and pigs and cows. Shit oh man, I seen the horse. Oh man, the dog. I seen the dog video. I seen it all, man. Right. So we ain't making this shit up, man. So we got witnesses. They eat. They, they got they, facts. They're the videos. Cause the scripture says that you they can't be called guilty. You gotta have at least. Uh, two or three witnesses to prove that someone's guilty of a crime. Mm -hmm. So these women, you want me they take up on my phone so we, we can do Nah, nah, and we get channel video deleted. Right. So right. Er, er, we done seen the videos. Okay, <laughs> y'all guilty. Right. Guilty. Guilty. And that's why we out here. Is that's why the Bible referred to as watchmen. Watchmen. What does a watchman do? Sit down, and watch, and secure the the, the the stock on a shelf in a grocery store. Nah. The watchman is placed here to, to look at these people commit, break the laws of the Heavenly Father. And we're witnesses that these people are content, they, they don't want to turn from it. So we're watchmen, we're out here uh, 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 professing the Lord's word and telling these people that they need to turn from their wicked ass ways or like we're reading, get burnt up in the fucking fire. That fire is good, that's common too. I like what we say. Oh, go ahead, go ahead, read that. Behold, I will cast her into a bed and them that commit adultery with her into great tribulation. All right, let me read this again real okay. quick. Uh, Ecclesiastes 26 and 25. A shameless woman shall be counted as a dog, but she that is shamefaced will fear the Lord. I just wanted to read the rest you, of it. You, I, mean, I don't see no women that's shamefaced. Nah, not too many. Honestly, I don't, I don't know any. I don't fucking know any. And that bitch got her head covered. Uh, she been Muslim. Yeah, the only women that in it have any kind of order are the Muslim women. <laughs> and they were the other nations. And they were, yeah, the other, they heathens. You know what? The Bible mentions that how the other nations are going to be going well, to do as well. Yeah, but a lot of them are Israelites. She's scattered. Yeah. I've seen a lot of fine ass Muslim women and they yeah, they be have their head covered, but they be Israelites. So that, that that's one of the reasons why you can't just be going and want to go kill all the Muslims. We're going to go kill. We're actually gonna go kill them. We're gonna get some guns, and we're gonna, oh, you know, like the government goes on drops bombs on them. Right. You ain't supposed to actually go kill people, cause, cause we act, you're supposed to teach them the gospel. That's what you're supposed to do. 
Because our people are scattered among the heathen. But we do wish death on the Muslim. If you're a Muslim and you stay a Muslim, if, if, if we teach you this truth, if you're calling yourself a Muslim, and then we teach you the truth and you still reject the truth, we pray that you uh, die. We pray that the Lord kills you and destroys you. I'm not sure if I'm here. Uh, this is what I'm reading. It goes in too quick. Just look at that. Um, this is uh, 2 Nezzers 3 and 31. Um, I do not remember how this way may be left, or they then of Babylon better than they of Zion. Or is there any other people that knoweth thee beside Israel? Or that generation have so believed thy covenants as Jacob? And yet their reward appeared not, and their labor had no fruit. For I have gone here and there through the heathen, the and I see that they flow in wealth and think not upon thy commandments. Weigh thou therefore our wickedness now in the balance, and theirs also that dwell in the world, and so shall thy name nowhere be found but in Israel. Or when was it that they which dwell upon the earth have not sinned in thy sight? Or what people have so kept thy commandments? Thou shalt find that Israel by name have kept thy precept, but not the heathen. Yeah, uh, like the so-called Jews. That's all good. But that, that goes back to the Jews. We was talking about the Jews earlier. They're some goddamn heathens. They don't follow the commandments of the Lord, all right? So over there in Israel, they, they don't even follow the Bible. They follow the uh, they follow the Talmud. And, then, and also, they because they proof they go against the Bible, they said for you to be a real Jew, your mother has to be a Jew. You ever hear that bullshit? That's how them Jews uh, tell if they're Jewish or not. And they say if your mother's Jewish, that means you're Jewish. Right. When the, Bi the Bible, when, when you read the Bible, the Bible says your nationality is determined by your father, not your mother. When you read all the genealogies in the Bible, it's all men. Ain't hardly no women up in there. You know what I'm saying? Right, right, right. Because that's proof to them, them so-called Jews, they're not keeping the laws of the Most High. They're a bunch of heathens. That's right. Here, let me read that of Matthew's the first chapter. Some of that. Let me read some of it. Yeah. No. I think it's Matthew. They teach it's okay to molest little boys too. We was, I was watching uh no, I was reading this article on Vice. You know that, that channel Vice on YouTube? They got an HBO channel too, I think. Well Vice it's called Vice. They they make documentaries. But they had this one piece, I read it as an article. I don't, I don't know if they have a video, I didn't but I, I read an article, and they said this dude was up in Canada, up, up in the, the Jewish bathhouses, and he said he's seen a bunch of rabbis raping little boys in their ass. He said it was the most disgusting thing he'd ever seen in his life. It just That's what the rabbis do, because the Talmud, they, cause they don't follow the Bible, they follow the Talmud. And at the Talmud says it's okay for them to rape little boys. <laughs> the Talmud is a book of witchcraft. They're, they're a bunch of witches. You see them, they all dress in black. They all have the nasty little curls hanging down. They're a bunch of foul people, man. A bunch of foul, wicked devils. A bunch of heathens. Hey, what, uh, you about to read something? Yeah, I found it. I this up. Let me read this one. Bring that coffee. <laughs> Let me read this real quick. This is John 8 and 12. And then spake Yahweh Shai unto them, saying, I am the light of the world. He that followeth me shall not walk in darkness, but shall have the light of life. So the Bible says if you follow the Lord, the one they call Jesus Christ, in the ancient Hebrews name is Yahweh Shai. If you follow Yahweh Shai, what does it say? You'll have the light of life. Now them so-called Jews, they, they don't follow the Lord. They, they, you know what I'm saying? They say that uh, they actually got verses in, in that Talmud book they got. They say, uh, they say this, what's this goddamn part of the Goddamn hoopty. I'm talking about but check this out in the town the town says that the one you call Jesus is a uh, 
burning and uh, boiling in human feces and human shit for all eternity. It said Mary a whore. She's a whore. Yeah, it said, it said his mother was a whore. And then it, it said that uh, they say that he didn't resurrect, that he actually died, and he's in hell forever burning in human excrement. That's what the devil believes, too. So so they obviously, let me read this again. This is more proof those are a bunch of devils. Because you got a bunch of dumb jackasses out here in these churches. These churches teach that those so called Jews are the real children of God. And that even though they don't believe in the Lord, that we, that we still have to respect them because those are the original people, okay? We gotta respect the goddamn thing. Uh, John 8 and 12. Then Jesus spake unto them, saying, I am the light of the world. He that followeth me shall not walk in darkness, but shall have the light of life. <laughs> so them them devils ain't got no life. They're a bunch of they they a bunch of faggots. That's right. That's right. Here's that one that seat, man. Look at these motherfucking neon green heathens. Get them neon that's green. That's the thing with these men, man. Oh, they yeah. all wearing these fluorescent colors. That's, the, colors, that's some heathens too. Yeah. You should be you see up in the gym, man, be some big ass niggas wearing some gay ass colors, man. I'm like, what the fuck? Yeah, but you know in the spirit that they all fags anyway, man. A lot of them be get, taking the branding iron and, you know, putting those signs on them and shit, man. They probably be fucking each other over in the shower. Hey, yeah, that's why they walk around in the showers and the, not just the shower, the locker room butt naked, man. I'd be scared to go back to up in there. Yeah, man. That's some foul ass shit, man. Wait till I get home to take a shower. Right, that's why I don't take shit, man. I don't touch that gym anyway, man. Probably, yeah, you know. It's probably all kind of shit the, laying oh, on that man. floor, swimming around on the floor. That's man. nasty, man. You know, faggot ass shit. So you from America? Where are you from? You from China? God damn gooks. My grandpa used to stack y'all as sandbags. Oh yeah, what's that? Where are you from, baby? Your boy, now what, Gran Torino? When your Clint Eastwood yeah, yeah, was talking yeah. about stacking, this most recent one is he was talking about stacking them using dukes and sandbags. <laughs> you know, he used off the sandbags <laughs> or something. He said the way he said it was smooth. <laughs> um, this is Jerry. This is Isaiah 60 and 10. Um, and the sons of strangers shall build up thy walls, and their kings shall minister unto thee. For in my wrath I smote thee. But in my favor, have I had mercy on thee? Oh yeah, so those heathens, they're going into slavery. Because when we get in the kingdom, we ain't going to be doing no work. Yeah, we're going to we're gonna have workers for that. You know, what we're going to do is banging the shit out of our women. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> they go to the, the, the Soviet fucking republic. <laughs> What's that, the CCP? That shit cracks me up when I see it. Yeah, man. That's some funny That shit. just looks like it's straight out of the Soviet Union. George some Zimmerman. Oh, yeah, some Zimmermans. Some Zimmermans, right. The Zimmermans supposed to fight DMX. Yeah, they canceled it, though. Oh, did they cancel it? That motherfucker was at a gun show the other day, and he was signing out, all signing autographs. Who was, Zimmerman? Zimmerman, mm -hmm. Famous. White people love Zimmerman. Oh, man, they love that motherfucker. Man, he's a hero. <laughs> I'm glad, though, I mean, because that's the vibration that's supposed to be going on right now. A uh, 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 separation of separation. You remember that, like when the first couple of days when that Zimmerman thing happened and Trayvon Martin, right here at Ohio State University, somebody spray painted one of these buildings big as fuck, long live Zimmerman. It was right here on this building. <laughs> oh, was it this one? <laughs> yeah. Hell no. So that's, that's the spirit of division that's out here. Yeah, yeah. You know? Yeah. That just tells you the attention. Yeah. You know, it's, if you can't feel it, man, you just totally non-spiritual, you know, totally non-spiritual. Where's that at, um, where's that at? Isn't that Luke? Well, um, division, division. Um, Cause they still, you know, in the hood, they still believe that bullshit that, you know, uh, uh, America is, uh, is a new America. That we all hold hands and we all friends and, and, and like I said, there's a new America, especially if you listen to the black woman. Because the black woman is definitely teaching her kids that uh, racism doesn't exist no more. There is no more racism. Well, hell, we racist, you know? To be, to be in a, 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 the mindset of a, a, a righteous man, an authority, a ruling king, 
uh, that's he's a racist. The Most High is a fucking racist. So um, the Most High is visiting this world which he made. So you're gonna see a whole lot of this division going on. It's gonna be a whole lot of this division. Now, like the scripture says, like uh, though hand joining hand, the wicked shall not be unpunished. And what does America and Babylon push? That man joins in hand. If we all want that one world order bullshit. Shit. Yeah, that's why they flood in America with goddamn heathens. You see, you see they, just walk by. they shipping goddamn Hindus in by the boatload. <laughs> Man, you got so many, got, you got whole neighborhoods of goddamn Somalians. Uh, some goddamn herd of Somalians that come through like zombies off the walking dead yeah. and just take over your hey, shit. And they motherfuckers stick together too. Yeah, and they stink too. <laughs> Man, I'm just saying that they, they doing that shit, bro. And that's that, uh, that's that word. That, it's that word that we, we forgot is gentrification. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's, when That's the what they call it, gentrification. Right. And when they replace your ass with some heathens, yep, it's yep. when they ship heathens in and push you out of the neighborhood. That's right. Here you go. This is. Let me ask you a question. Do you have a problem with all the Somalians and Muslims walking around? You know what? I don't. Why not? Because they're, because they're uh, God's there? people just like us. They're God's they're people. They're not God's people. Why do you say that? What God do you believe in? What God are you talking about? Jesus Christ is my Lord and Savior. All right. And he created all men. Yeah, well, you, you want... All right, go ahead. Well, I got, I got news for you. What does the Bible say about an antichrist? If somebody who does not believe... Out of the east. If somebody doesn't believe in Christ, what, what, that's an antichrist, right? What is, the Muslims, they don't, they don't believe that Jesus... The antichrist is the antithesis Jesus Christ, which, which is the son. I'll get it. Okay, here you go. This is second he was Ezra's, God's right hand angel. This is second Ezra 6 out. and 53. Upon the sixth day thou gavest commandments unto, unto the earth, that before thee it shall bring forth beast, cattle, and creeping things. And after these, Adam also, whom thou madest Lord of all thy creatures, of him come we all, and the people also whom thou hast chosen. I'm gonna get that. Don't worry about that. You're gonna just sound and listen to me. Right, All this have I spoken before thee, O Lord, because thou madest the world for our sake. So the world was, this is talking to Israel. The, the world was- reading out of it? This is the Bible. The book what, of Ezra. What, what is that book that you got your finger on? The book of 2nd Ezra. Oh, so why is there 2nd Ezra? This is the Bible, part of the Bible. You know, the prophet no, Ezra. I'm just asking what's the name of it. Oh, the Apocrypha. The, the book I'm reading is 2nd Ezra. Okay. It's out of King James. Okay. As for the other people, which also came of Adam, thou hast said that the, they the, are nothing. The other people, it said we all come from Adam. Israel comes from Adam and the heathen also come from Adam. So read that again, please. As for the other people, which also come of Adam, thou hast said that they are nothing, but be like unto spittle, <laughs> and hast likened the abundance of them unto a drop that falleth from a vessel. Yeah, so a Somalian is, is comparable to a pile of dog manure, you know, okay? That's a heathen. Unless, however, some of our people are scattered among the heathen. And we can tell through the spirit if they are one of God's children. Here you go, okay? Exodus 11 and 7. This is Exodus 11 right. and 7. But against any of the children of Israel shall not a dog move his tongue. Oh, yeah. Against man or beast, that ye may know that how that the Lord doth put a difference between the Egyptians and Israel. Right, because the Egyptians, they weren't, I mean, if we're all God's people, how come the Lord didn't choose Egypt? He destroyed Egypt, destroyed all the firstborn sons, <laughs> plagued them with plagues, and then drowned the Pharaoh and all, his, all of his hosts in the Red Sea. He didn't, and then he gave the law They're to pretty Israel. resilient people though, aren't they? They Ooh. kept coming back. The Egyptians? No, the, the fact, no, not the Egyptians, man. The fact that the Jewish are even here. The Jew is a oh, miracle. Now, buddy. Jewish is a, is a miracle. Yeah, Jew wish? Jew wish? wish? Jew wish? Jews. The Jews. You're looking man. at the Jews. Well, you're looking at the you're Jews. You're looking at the real biblical Jews right here. Uh, oh, okay, let me I'm ask not, you. Not gonna get those into, rats in I'm Israel not ain't Jews. Of course, you don't know now. Because oh, okay. those rats over in Israel right now, what nation are those people in Israel right now if you know what you're talking about? Are they, what are they? Hebrew what? Hebrew what? 
They're Hebrew Edomites. That's why they call not them. Israelites. They're Edomites. Let, let me, they're Khazars. Now the Bible. Now, hold on a second. The Bible says you shall know them by their fruits. Okay. Now let, now let me read this scripture for you, and then we're, we're going to we're going to judge a righteous judgment according to what the scripture says. All right. Now listen to this. This is First John uh, two. And actually, I'm going to start at 20. But ye have an unction from the Holy One, and ye know all things. So the Lord has blessed us with wisdom and knowledge. Okay, and we have an unction from the Most High and the Son. He said, I have not written unto you because ye know not the truth, but because ye know it, and that no lie is of the truth. Okay? Who is a liar but he that denieth that Jesus is the Christ? He, he is antichrist that denieth the father and the son. That kills the Muslims and them Jews that you was just taking up for. They're I'm liars. Not, hold on, back up. They're Put the brakes on, bro. I'm not, I'm not taking up for nobody. Yeah, please don't. The only, the only person I take up for is my one true boss, and that's All right, him. that's good. All right, and what it comes down to is everything that you can say, I mean, I love it that you guys are here, but everything's rhetoric, dude. All right, it's all rhetoric, it's rhetoric. because we don't, know, we don't know. We don't know the true answer, except that he has come and he has come. And what did he give us this book for? If we don't know the true okay. answer. Okay, listen. What's this book for? Is it just a novel you read when you go take a shit? It has no. <laughs> but you know what? But it also says when it, when the time has come and he comes back, that Bible will be useless. How is that? All right. you read it. It's in there, man. Doesn't it say you'll find wisdom and knowledge to be the stuff well, No, that, that Bible. Will it will, be, when he comes it will back, be written in your heart. It's this already kingdom. written in my this heart. When he comes oh, back, that, that, that Bible will be worthless. What's your nationality? How is the Bible going to be worthless? I, I'm just saying, when he comes it's in there, man. But no, that's the said, kingdom. That's said, the kingdom. No, I'm no. saying the Bible. It's just the but word. The, hold up. The, the Bible it's says. Just the word. Now listen. The, before paper was invented, there was the word. Okay? The word, the Holy Spirit, it's the spirit. The Most High is the spirit. His word is spirit. It's the rivers of living water. That's right. Okay, because this word, all it is is the righteous men wrote down what the Most High inspired them to write. Listen, you know okay. what, you know what, man? But it was what, what it comes spirit. down to, and this is this is what I, and this is coming from my heart. That's I don't, I don't, I don't know. Your heart. Your heart. I don't know what God's will is. Oh, we, but we I do know. You. Well, hold on, man, but I do know what it isn't. No. All right. So, well, if you don't know what it is, but how would you know if it isn't? If you don't know <laughs> the things is. that I do when I do them, That's I know a, they're not right. Well, here you go. Check this out. I this do, is Jeremiah my, my 17 and 9. Guys. Jeremiah 17 and 9. The yeah. heart is deceitful above all things. You said you. You said and desperately right. wicked. Who can know it? I'm a liar, man. You're, you're, you're right. I was born. A, I was born a liar. <laughs> at least you admitted it. I was born a liar. At, le at least you just to lie until though. I don't. At least Even as they were born, they start to speak lies. Well, right. well, good thing you're not lying now. All right, down there. Dear to each maid to Bryce Grove and Scarborough Boulevard. That was a good one. Oh my goodness, man. He he just admitted he. Well, I'm a liar. He just he's admitted. Right. That was the spirit that made him do that. Devil. He admitted it though. You know, I give him. Yeah, Give the devil a hand. That dude wasn't right, man. Oh, yeah. He didn't know a goddamn thing about the scripture. He's he a goddamn devil. He they see America's falling, and now they now they want to turn to Jesus. But he's taken up. He See, he's one of the people who, who wants to accept a Somalian up in the neighborhood. <laughs> now, who the he fuck? Yeah, but nobody... You know you know goddamn well when he yeah, with his family like I, these goddamn Somalians. You know what you you know you you can imagine how he's speaking about all the niggas. Like, Issachar, oh Issachar. Issachar. no, no, black people. You know they talk about black people worse than anybody. <laughs> they just they goddamn niggers. <laughs> That's all. It, it, I got no love for these dudes, man. So man, I got no love for these dudes, man. Yeah, fuck these people, man. Goddamn stupid ass antichrist. That's all he was. They said if you don't believe in the Lord, you're not an <laughs> like, what the fuck? <laughs> that's the shit these people say, man. Yeah. That's good for a few laughs. Yeah. Right. Man, it's fun. It's fun. It's fun reading the scriptures and seeing what the Bible really says. He said it's hard, <laughs> Goddamn fool. Goddamn faggot. <laughs> Let me find that out. He did had a foul spirit on him. No, you know, I can we need some more. We need some more people to talk to. Yeah, we gotta get some more people over here. <laughs> oh, That's shit. a damn shame, man. I forgot what we was talking about. That wicked food. 
He know that motherfucker don't care less. Now he see that America's about to get burnt the fuck up. Now he see that big bear over in the east is rising up. Oh, let's get that man you know to 24. Yeah, I mean, now that he see this is happening, now he, he probably lost his job, but got laid off. His wife probably threw his ass out too. Because she found out he was a goddamn faggot. Now he want to turn to Jesus. Jesus Christ, my Lord, my Savior. Yeah, right, right. You shut right. the fuck up, man. <laughs> They, but when they always quick to say that, but when you say, hey, let's talk about Jesus. Let's all sit and read the Bible together. And you start reading the Bible, and, and you start seeing that whole little fairy tale world crumble apart. And then they realize they don't know shit. They don't know shit. And then you do walk away confessing that he was a liar. Fucking faggot. It is dead out here. What? Ain't there a school right now? Uh, yeah, this good. This good. Matthew 24. Unless they left at spring break. Nah, this spring break ain't yet. It ain't yet. At least I don't know. I know we run up on that time of spring break when everybody gonna party, committing more and more adultery. Dude, it's a weird That's shit. That's spring break time. That's adultery time right there. Yep. Yeah, all these women go down in Mexico and fucking. I went to spring break down in Mexico once. I never seen so much pussy in my whole life. Mm. So many goddamn bitches. I was in the club, I was with a bitch, and then I lost her. They're like, no big deal, just get a new one. It, it was just so many. It, I've never seen, and it, I've never seen nothing like it. So these bitches love going out of Mexico and being a whore. Mm -hmm. Here, here, here. Oh, this is a uh, Psalms 58, and um, I'm just gonna start at three, the point is at, I'm um, starting one, point is at three though. Psalms 58 and one. Um, do ye indeed speak righteousness, O, o congregation? Do ye judge iniquity, O ye sons of men? Yea, in heart ye work wickedness. Ye weigh the violence of your hands in the earth. The wicked are estranged from the womb. They go astray as soon as they be born, speaking oh, yeah. lies. As soon as these little bastards is born, they, like they born devils. Like as soon as an Edomite's born, he's a devil right from the birth. As soon as he pops out, he, out his mama's pussy, he's a damn devil. And that devil admitted he was a liar. That's why a lot of times people will say, uh, oh, there's no such thing as evil children. Well, there, I've seen plenty of little evil children walking around. Look, you've seen little devil children, they torturing cats. You really see the kids, don't you? And they torture animals and they hurting other kids, yep. and trying to stab other kids. Yep.